Hi, and welcome to the channel. Something slightly different today. Well, I've uploaded something, so it's already quite different. But what I really meant was there's a bit of a change in content. I've been snowed under lately, and I've decided to do some more spontaneous videos instead of letting the channel wither and die further. I've recorded a number of live narrations, which takes much less time to do than the historical ones, but I'm still not that well practiced at it. So if you could go easy on me to begin with, that'd be marvellous. Okay, enough of this. The first one is the Puma. And here we go. Right, we're on the 38th parallel. I'm not sure what to take out. I'm going to take some of these pointy ones and uh, a whole bunch of these barrel-shaped fellas. And we'll just dive in. I haven't really used this vehicle much. This is the uh, 2.7 uh, BR-rated Puma. Uh, recently introduced for the German line. I think it was in 1.69. I've been very behind on my videos recently. I've been so busy. So these are these are a bit of a departure. They're going to be a bit rough because they're just uh, ooh, I'm just getting the hang of steering this thing. I think the front four wheels and the rear four wheels all have independent steering, but they point in opposite directions when you turn. So it takes a bit of getting used to. Yep. Okay. So we're through that bit. So I'm going to get hidden uh, as I creep up on C and uh, see what's what. So yeah, I've been pretty busy, and uh, I haven't had time to put together the historical ones as I usually do. Uh, hang on. Oh, clipped him in the engine. Let's see if he's still out. No, he managed to crawl behind cover. It's another Puma. I always feel a bit a bit bad about uh, getting people in, in the same vehicles I'm driving. I don't know why. I think probably because if it happens to them, it could happen to me. Anyway, uh, back to the new format. Yeah, it's going to be... Uh, rougher because it's live live narration over gameplay and uh, and I thought I'd better get hang on M3 no longer oh excuse me what's that ah that's a boat you chug off in that direction um so yeah just an experiment really if you like it then uh, hit the like button and uh, if you don't then uh, pr probably stop watching about now it's not going to get any better hang on Oh, tracked him. What was that? Give him another one. It's a hard go. There's quite a lot of crew in there, but they're all squashed up. I say a lot. There's three. I don't know what I'm talking about. So creep up a bit closer. There's no one there. We're taking it. I think it was that uh, that American boat actually, uh, actually taking it. Hang on. Oh, I missed a shot there. Never mind. He's safely ensconced behind that large rock. And there's somebody else coming down as well. And a third one closer to the spawn point. Oh, somebody else behind. Excuse me, sir. So, we're hiding behind this rock. They're hiding behind that rock. I'm not going to spend too much time here because uh, it's boring. And uh, I've got this gun on wheels, which I've been looking forward to playing. Oh, there's another one. Oh, no, there isn't. Okay. Well, so far, uh, I'm rather enjoying this. It's a nice long wheelbase. Um, it's got a decent gun on it. It's a KWK 39 stroke one, 50 mil. Take a shot. Nothing. No worries. Can carry 55 shells. Uh, gun depression of minus 10 degrees and an elevation of uh, minus 20. Let's just hose down that cloud. See if we can ping anyone. Nothing. Rotation speed. Oh, another one. There's a lot of these about. Oh, missed him. Never mind. I'm sure he'll be out very shortly. Let's just push through because uh, I'm bored. Uh, I know he's just behind here, but I don't know what shape he's in. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna take a chance. Oh, he's just fired. So. 
put one through his driver. So he's sat there, but uh, you see the depression is not bad on these things. So uh, he's still dangerous. Miss that one. I shall try another one. No, I won't. He's pointing straight at me, waiting for me to come around the corner. So I shall pull back a bit. Try and drop something on him to get him moving. Oh, there's someone going around that side. Oh, and someone going around this side. So I'm going to sneak around the back and see if I can't surprise him. There he is. And, yeah, took him. Sorry about that, chaps. It was a bit of a steal, but there we go. Okay, there's two more pushing down from the north. And there's one to the west, which uh, I'm covered from, but it's always worth keeping an eye out. Oh, there's three to the north and two up by the spawn point. So this could get a bit warm. Well, let's hope it does. There's lots of firing but from behind rocks here. Push up a bit closer. See what we can see. A bit more arty. Have a poke round here. Oh. And there's one. He's not looking in my direction, so I can push forward. Panzer 3F. That's messed him up nicely, but somebody appeared just behind him. I didn't quite get a, a good look at what it was. A bit more arty. Oh, it's an M8, and I missed him. Snapshot. The reload on this is nice and fast, so... Oh, that's him gone. So, um... You can, ah, damn. Gonna have to... Ah, damn, who's getting me? I, can, I can't put the fire out just yet, because I'm... Oh, I'm out in the open. Okay. See what the repair... Oh, 36 repair time. He's out of range of my RT. I think, actually, somebody's knocked him off, so we might be able to repair. That would be handy. The engine's gone, and the transmission's gone. I am rather out in the open, but I've got a friend behind me, even though he's repairing. Let's see if I can't hit that mountain. Yes, success. See if I can miss this aeroplane. Yep, more success. Okay, I'm repaired. Let's get uh, up behind a rock. I'm still not entirely uh, used to this map yet, um, but I, I do enjoy it. When it's going well, when you get a good match on it, it's it's a very good map. Uh, but if you get in the higher tiers, you tend to get uh, bogged down in sniping matches, and it can be a bit uh, bit disheartening. I'm going to shoot past here in the hope that I'm slightly faster than whoever's looking down, and I've managed it. Because A's flashing, and... I think that needs rescuing. So we'll take a shortcut down here. Oh, Who's that? Can they see me? I can't really see them. I'll try a shot. Nothing. So if... Uh, oh, suspension. Um, if they can't see me, or if I can't see them, rather they can't see me, I'm safe enough for the moment. This is going to play havoc with the crew. So, okay, there's two of ours on A. We're taking it back. That's good. It's a nice active team. And B's coming round too. But we'll still keep pushing because, well, you know how fast it can uh, change. Oh, the knackered transmission is, uh, is making itself felt a bit now. Someone up there. Oh, Stig, is this the end of me? Um... No, that's the end of him. That's nice. More fire extinguisher action. <laughs> this has lasted a lot longer than I, I thought it was going to, actually. I'm quite impressed. It's taken a number of good knocks. Okay, so there's one of our guys on B. It's not turning blue, so is it, is it a case of one of theirs on there as well? And it's in stalemate. Huh. No. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to have to find a shallower incline to uh, to get up. 
hopefully just take this as a, a bit more of an angle and that should be uh, a bit kinder yep a bit slower but we're getting there okay B's turned red so we are needed down here that's good A looks safe C they've taken C back but there's a there's a fair mob of, oops bugger and there's a fair mob of us down there we should be able to push through but for the moment we'll uh, we'll see if we can't have B back getting a bit of speed up here it's 30 miles per hour top speed incidentally um, I, I'm not sure what that is in, uh, in kilometers but uh, you'll, you'll all have access to the internet you can work it out for yourselves oh, it's really not made for town driving though you need a bit of a uh, bit of open space for this vehicle okay so we're taking this back nicely and we've got all three which is nice so C's, we got B, A still R's, pick up a bit more, a uh, bit more ammo. Oh, damn it, I moved. Hang on. And C's, C's R's too. Okay. One more round. Oh, stop moving. I'm my own worst enemy. Well, the tickets are definitely in our favour. We've got all three points. And the red is coming down, but we've still got tanks in the field. What's this one? This is a... <laughs> thank you. A T-26. Which exploded very nicely. Thank you. And there's somebody else on the map I can see just over there. I'm not sure what he is yet. Now let's see if we can get a shot in before, uh, before the curtain drops. There we go. T-34. Hit his loader and his cannon breach. So can we get no <laughs> okay fair enough and I th think that might be the lot of them unless there's uh, anyone hiding away but that was a good match it, um, it shifted back and forth but um, I think we held it pretty well there we go survivor oh well that's not bad oh blimey Let's have a quick look at the scores. I got seven, not bad by any by any measure. Got the survivor medal, which is always nice, although it doesn't happen often enough. And twenty two thousand six hundred and seventy five silver lies, not bad for a low tier match. I still came in at fourth place, and the top score was also seven kills. And uh, he managed to beat me by nearly a thousand points by one more assist, as far as I can tell, even though he died twice and I didn't die at all. OK, I hope you like the new format. Um, like it if you do, don't if you don't. And I'll hopefully see you for the next one, which will be along very shortly. Bye bye.